Howdy friends, fellow beer geeks, I'm Wes, the Craft Beer Geek, and tonight we're going to do another beer review for you. Uh, tonight's beer is from Schlenkerla out of uh, Bamberg, Germany. This is a, a well-known uh, smoke beer producing company, and this is their Oak Smoke. It's a, a holiday beer they produce. Uh, comes in at 8% alcohol by volume. Uh, 40 IBUs and uh, the, the specialty with this beer is typically their uh, smoked beers are smoked with beech wood uh, but this one in particular is smoked with oak wood so it gives it a little bit uh, different flavor uh, a little bit more complexity in the smoke supposedly I haven't tried this one this is my first time uh, trying this particular one so I'm really excited to get this uh, get a taste of this um, as you may or may not know, I'm a huge fan of smoked beer, so um, I really wanted to get my hands on a bottle of this. I saw Ryan uh, Stumpy Joe Jr. give this a review earlier this year, and uh, I hadn't seen it before, and I, I looked around for it, and finally was able to find a bottle, and I wanted to go ahead and give this a taste. Even though this is a holiday beer, and it's well after the holidays, it's you know, it's the end of, end of April here when I'm filming this, so... But smoke beer is good anytime as far as I'm concerned. So let's go ahead and get this into a glass and I'll let you know what I think of it and let you know if I think you should uh, seek it out yourself uh, next year. And this is a double box style, if I'm not sure if I mentioned that or not. Um, yeah, it's very, very, pours very, very clear. Um, I poured it pretty aggressively and only got a very small one finger, half a finger head. I do get quite a bit of smoke in the aroma. I was worried that this would be uh, more subdued and not as extreme as I, I would like, I like smoke beers to be, but, um, you know, uh, Schlenkerla has never let me down so far as far as uh, not being smoky enough, so this one smells really great. Just a nice, rich, smoky aroma to it. It does smell like an oak, you know, an oak smoke, you know, like a, like a, like a piece of oak that's been charred. Um, has a really nice, rich aroma to it. So let's go ahead and give this a taste and I'll let you know what I think of it. Very, very nice, very smooth. Um, it is, it's, it's pretty smoky, but it's a really smooth smokiness. Uh, a lot of people's complaints about smoked beers that, that they feel like they're uh, licking, the, licking the inside of an ashtray or something. This is, this is definitely a lot smoother than that. A lot, a, a lot richer. Um, like a, it is an eight percent beer, so it's it's very sweet and malty. So it's it's like a like a nice sweet barbecue sauce uh, uh, on a nice you know a rack of ribs or something. You know, it's just it's got all that sweetness and richness and smokiness that that makes barbecue so good. Just like a little in the way of carbonation, but it, it's not it's not that bad really. I'm, you know, it's not. It's not a super heavy mouthfeel, it's more of a medium mouthfeel. Um, I, don't, I don't even know if more carbonation would make this better or not. Um, it's, it's very lightly carbonated. It's funny, I get a lot more of the smoke in the nose than I do in the actual flavor, you know. There's, uh, with the flavor there's a lot of sweet maltiness going on and it's, it's more balanced. Um, it is still it is still smoky. Um, this is not this is definitely not a lightly smoked beer. It's it's you know, it's, it's it's really smoky, but it's not as intense as as some of their other smoked beers that are just all smoke. This is this is a very malty, rich smoke. <clears throat> on the finish, I'm getting a bit of a sensation of an alcohol bite on this. Um, it's, it's not bad, but you're, you definitely know that you're getting something that's it's got some, got a bit of alcohol in it. 
No, it's not. It's not hidden. It's not subdued. It's there. It'd be interesting if they would take this maybe even a little further with the, with the sort of holiday theme and maybe put get some spices in here or something. It, it might be it might be even more interesting. It's it's you know it, it's uh, it maybe lacks a little bit of complexity that that maybe you would want, um, but just as a smoked beer, it's it's very good. This does come in in a 16.9 uh, ounce bottle. Um, that's uh, 550. It doesn't say, but 16.9 ounce bottle. I believe I paid around 6.49 for this bottle. Um, it was it was a little bit more than than their other smoke beers, but not much. 50 cents or a dollar more. But I do like that sweet multi caramel um, flavor that I'm getting from the from the multi, heavy maltiness of this beer and uh, the smooth oaky smokiness is, is going really nice. It's a lot, like I said, it's a lot more balanced than some of their other beers. Uh, if, if you've tried their other smoke beers in the past and you thought they were just too much on the smoky side, uh, maybe, tr maybe give this a try. Um, it is, like I said, it still is, it's very smoky. Um, but it's 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 toned back a little bit. It's more balanced, I should say. It's not really toned back. It's more balanced. You know, they brought the added in more malts, and it's it's uh, you know just a sweet carameliness with the smooth oaky smoke. Uh, it's 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 interesting, and it's and it's fun to uh, fun to have something different like this for the holidays or whenever you know. <laughs> but it's fun to have a special you know uh, special seasonal release that only comes out once a year. So I guess I'm ready to go ahead and give a rating on this. I uh, I like it a lot. I'm not sure where I'm coming in. I think I'm coming in at around an eight out of ten on this. It's almost a nine, but it, it's just it's right there around a, a good solid eight. It's 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 good. It's not my favorite smoke beer, uh, it, but it's well made. It's 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 tasty. Yeah. So that's the Shinkerla. Schen Doppelbach Oak Smoke, 8% um, ABV, and I guess that's all I have to say about it, 8, eight out of 10. I'm Wes, the Craft Beer Geek. You can find this review plus more over at craftbeergeek.com, and remember, I don't drink bad beers. You shouldn't either. See you next time. Cheers.